Welcome to episode 109 of Let's Play Final Fantasy XII. Good news! We get the weapon of ass destruction this episode. Bad news! We're in one of my least favorite places in the game. It's the other part of the big five. Or six, if you will. Yeah, the Necro Halls of Nabudis. There are some millions of reasons why I hate this. Well, there's not really millions of reasons. There's actually three. Okay, make that four. Anyway, before I get into that, what Bosch is telling us is this is the result of Sid's resource. Research. Ugh. Not research. What am I saying that for? Earlier in the game, a loud explosion happened during the War of Nebradia. Well... This is what happened. This is all that's left of this place. And of course, Boss says that if you're going to Arcades and going to... Well... Yeah, and also I got the Zodiac Spear. The thing is, the computer froze when I recorded it, so... We end up right here where Balthier was standing where the chest used to be. Anyway, I was about to say that was the end result. Yeah, both. I mean, Bosch has that little um cutscene. We are going to either the Feywood or Arcades. So yeah, it'll be a fool's errand nonetheless, and it is a fool's errand. Cause here's the reason why I hate this place. First and foremost. Not the fact that it's a level 50 dungeon, no, but the fact that there are enemies that can ambush you out of the mist. It took me hell to get up here. Notice all of my characters were 48 when- no. Notice all of my characters were 50 and 51 when they come in here. By the time they leave, they'll all be almost level 52. This is a good place to grind. The thing is, the mist literally shrouds the location of some of the enemies, and that'd be the enemies that hurt, aka the Bakagami. The Bakagami are a pain in the ass in this stage. That's the first reason why I hate this place. Second reason why I hate this place. Oh, and before I get into that, more recording issues happen. Or more on the lines of I had to stop and go to the store. But, we're back. Anyway, second reason why I hate this place. You see, every time you kill a certain number of enemies, like 10 to 15, a monster by the name of Oversoul will appear and annul all of your magic and will cast moves that will either instantly kill you, or will cast doom and then kill you. It's it has the same. Oh, there's the fucker right now. It has the same look as Dustia, and it casts Phantasmal Rift, which kills both ear. Man, fuck this place. Oh wait, it gets worse. Here's the one reason why I really, really hate this play. Kill five of those Oversoul in a roll. Hal... Halvenaric, a rare creature, will come out of nowhere. And he will chase your characters throughout the board. He is a level 50 rare creature who has a 99,999 HP. Yeah, that's not good. You'd be like, oh, let's go be in the whip and take him, but come in low level and try to get the Zodiac Spear and successfully kill off five Oversouls and see how badly you will hate this place. Oh, one thing that really bugs me besides the fact that Alvenarek will chase you throughout the entirety of the Necro Halls and Abudis. Actually, no, there's two other things. Another thing. So in total, there actually is five reasons. Anyway, reason number four. 
there is a side quest that you have to do before you get the map to this place, which is why I'm going through here blindly. That's right. You don't get the map until you're in the midst of finishing that side quest. And that means having to kill two optional bosses that isn't here. But last but not least, the one thing, the main thing that made me hate the Necro Hall of Novelties... There is no safe point here! And you have two options. First option is to go back the way you came through Selika Wood and go to the same go to the safe point. Or Oh yeah, that's another thing. Okay, that makes six on the list because the places rigged to shit with traps. Anything. Anyway. Or you have to trudge through like I'm doing and go to the Nebraeus Deadlands. And now or why I hate the Nebraeus Deadlands. Oh, there's that prick again. I killed one of these things off screen and you saw me kill another. But anyway, now let's go to the reason why I don't like the Necro Halls, I mean the Nebraeus Deadlands. Now I think there's only two reasons. One, an annoying safe. Oh, god damn this. Ugh. Anyway, an annoying quest. An annoying side quest. Sorry, I fell off my bed there. Oh, shit. Um, my bike party is just in dire straits right now. But anyway, but an annoying side quest. That is part of the reason to get the um, optional bosses. It requires you to get these, I don't know, items. These medallions in order for you to open the doors. We have a problem with that. The area where you have to retrieve those said items is a high encounter area where dead bones will not stop rising. And what's worse, there's a mark in that particular area as well. But the worst part about the Nebraeus Deadlands, you see, you're trying to get out of the Necro Hall of Nobodies to get to the safe port in Nebraeus Deadlands. Turns out that one save point that is also a gate crystal is a crystal bug. So that's right, folks. You're running from a place with no save point whatsoever. Running from Oversouls that is pretty much taking your MP and leaving you for dead. Good chance that you get to run away from. Well, good chance you have to end up running from this place because Helvana Wreck is too tough. But the worst part about it all is even through all the hell and damnation, you come here through the Necro Halls and you manage to escape the Necro Halls. The save point kills you! What kind of bullshit is that? It's ridiculous! That's why I hate these two levels. I really hate coming here because there's a good chance... Oh god, not another Wizard Bane trap. Just, 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 fuck the Wizard Bane traps! Just about every trap in here has something to do to really screw your characters. I have to come back here later because there's a hidden chest that not only has, I mean a hidden shop here in Necrohall and Abadis that not only has 
the Maximilian and the Demon Shield and the Golden Skullcaps, but also has Scaife and Telekinesis, the last two, the well, last spell and the last Technic you'll need to get throughout the entirety of the game. Basically the most useful ones, and yeah, I have to come back here later on after I defeat uh, Gira Vagan. Oh, Gory, here he comes again. That's the fourth time. Ugh. Four times in a fucking row. Man, one more time. I'm going to be running. And see what I mean about these things coming out of the mist, out of nowhere? You only see one on your screen. Another one pops right on up, just like that. I mean, it's the inconsistencies of this level, the Nebraeus Deadlands, the bullshit that is Gear of Vagan, which I'll be doing after I deal with the cleanup here, the boss rush of the Pharaohs. Yet, the level 60 dungeon in Hene Mines, which is exactly like the Necro Hall of Nabudis. Oh god, there's another one! Oh dear god, there's another one. Oh, I hate this level. Why? Why does this level curse me so? Oh my god. That's our fifth one. Ah, oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh well. Looks like I'll be running from this thing and telling you why I hate the rest of these boards in the next park. Part. Oh, I'm so pissed off that I can't even speak right. See you guys next time.